hi everyone welcome back to my channel if you are new here i'm isabel and i'm just going to shut this window actually um i'm isabel um i do videos uh, based on lifestyle bit of shopping bit of vlogging bit of bits here there and everywhere and um if i find an opportunity just to make a video like today i'm gonna do it so today is a B&M haul, just, I did one the other day actually, and I did upload it, but I went in today because I just wanted to avoid home bargains to be honest, because the queues was just long, there's a B&M, quite a big B&M by me, it's literally five minutes away, and I thought look, the bits that I need, I can just get from B&M, so I thought I'll pop in there, and then I noticed Dunelm, they were open, which is so surreal because the past few months it's just been all boarded off. You can't get in there, of course. Um, and there was no queue. There was no queue for B&M. There was no queue for Dunelm. So I thought I'm going to go to B&M, then I'm going to go to Dunelm. And that's what I did. And I did pick up some nice little gems, especially in B&M, Dunelm, sorry. They had quite a lot of sale items. I managed to pick a few bits up from there. So I thought... I actually wasn't going to do this today, but I thought, you know what, I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to record it, why not, and then upload it. So, let's get into it. I think I might, because I've actually, saying this, b and have got a few little new bits in, but I will say a lot of their shells are quite bare, especially in the home section. I'm not sure whether they're just trying to get rid of all the excess stock or the old stock, and then... Once it's everything started to calm down a bit, they're going to just bring out a whole new range. I'm hoping so. But let's get into the video properly because I've been talking for two minutes already. And let's just show you what I picked up. So, um, oh, the, the lighting's going to keep going off, I think, because of the light. Anyway, right, let's have a look. So, the one of, I'm just going to pick out whatever ran what is in the bag um so the first thing i picked up um was um some pillowcases this is the deluxe co collection from silent light these were 2.99 so you get a pair in there and i just picked up the like a gray um shade i do tend to go for white and i have got a white pair but when you're washing and taking off washing i just wanted another set basically and um, so i got that very exciting um oh when i was actually walking through when i first started going through um there was um a whole section of like anti-back um products you name it there was just everything there face masks blah 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 and i think these um in fact i think these were a pain but they are handy wipes antibacterial and kills 99.9 percent .9 of bacteria and it's literally you get 15 wipes really tiny you can fit in <laughs> you can fit in your little bag um, and I thought, you know what, I'm just going to pick some of them up because even though I do go shopping, I am careful. So I picked up some of them, but a pound. Then I spotted this. This is a um, wicker basket. Let me just show you really closely. And the this is from their Paradise um, Lux, L-U-X, um, range. And that was priced at five pounds. Now, I have got plenty of baskets, but I'm going to be honest. Now, while I'm in having another one, I love this. Two different shades. And pretty much my living room is full of this kind of material. Wicker. I love Wicker. Love. So, I picked up that. Like I said, that was five pounds really really nice let's have a look Ooh. bread um again this is just all random I'm just gonna show you what's in the bag from where i can see it um this is something for the car so tomorrow weather depending i am actually gonna spend time on my car i'm gonna thoroughly clean it 
just have some time with my car and <laughs> just I don't know I just feel like I can get someone to clean it but I just want to I know where it I can't explain it it just needs some tender loving care from the owner Um, I do generally get it clean like someone else cleans it and blah 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 but I just feel like I can't I want to do it Um, I don't know why I rambled on so much there but I picked up this so that B&M they've got like an RAC section um, and I have actually got my breakdown covered with our RAC but this is a two pack wiper and ca cameo set is that how you pronounce it? Um, so it's just some leather what would you call? yeah you know what I mean some of them and this um, and I picked up some of that because I thought I could use it for tomorrow and then I picked up the cone wheel brush for larger cone shaped brush for deeper cleaning, two ninety nine. So yeah, I picked up them too because, like I said, I'm thoroughly cleaning it. It needs it. Um, in the cleaning aisle, when I was on about elbow grease the other day, if you watched my other video, elbow grease, I had this was not in when I picked up all them products. But I found this. I didn't know this was it. But it's an elbow grease oven cleaning kit. It does say it's new actually. But my oven's not bad. I, I clean it. Every time I use it, I pretty much just wipe it down. I've got one of those liners at the bottom um, and things like that. But, you know, you do need to clean it every so often. And I saw this. This was one ninety nine, And you get um, a bag, a bottle and a pair of gloves and it's the only cleaner you'll ever need um i thought i'm gonna have to give this a try 100 percent um so if i can i'll let you know how that goes that was 199 um picked up some black bags exciting and then i picked up two lots of bleach i haven't seen this one before this is bleach plus 33% extra free so these were both a pound but I just got this oops the standard one and then I got this one stain remover hmm I don't know but you can't not have bleach I'm sorry if you haven't got bleach get it in your house because I love it down the sinks toilets you name it it's got bleach so I picked two of them up like I said a pound each some white vinegar we all know what that's for but I haven't had oh we've got a new lid actually that's a lot better because the other one every time I brought white vinegar spray the lid was horrific and it kept leaking so I'm hoping that doesn't but I kind of like how it's white on white don't ask um, some wraps you can't beat them put chicken in them salad yeah these are just brilliant quick easy tea and i picked up some butter chicken cooking sauce i love it i'm not a spice lover and i stepped up in the world from a korma to butter chicken now that might be embarrassing to state but i'm just going to state it anyway and then um i've got two plugins that i'm not currently using and um i needed two new plugins i want one for the living room um and possibly the kitchen can you have them in the kitchen a plug-in i think you can there's no harm in that but i've got one in the hallway so as soon as you walk in the living room there's a plug-in and you instantly know and that's what I, when people walk through the front door i want people to know that they that i live in a clean house so that's just yeah so I picked up these Airwick um, plug-in oil things and I got the scent um, Pacific Paradise Waves. They didn't have many other scents to be honest. Like I said, some of their shelves are quite bare. Um, but I picked up these two. Now for the pack of two, they're four ninety nine. I'm pretty much I think they are 4 99 and if you wanted a single one it's 2 99 um, but to be honest these are expensive anywhere but I just tend to get them from B&M or Round Bargains I just believe that they're just 
cheaper there. Oh, I need a drink already. I might even go I haven't even started the Dunelmo. If you haven't already, grab yourself a drink. I've got a cup of tea and it's milky, no sugar, and I've got it in these glass cups. Now, on, on, my, on my Instagram, um, which I'll link below in the description, um, I constantly talk about these glass cups because they're just amazing. £1.29 in Home Bargains. Um, Morrison's have them as well. They're a little bit taller and um which i quite like my mom has those ones because in home bargains when we went back again to get them for my mom they didn't have any in but morrison's do have them like i said a little bit taller and they are two pound each so you know you choose but like i said grab yourself a drink have a drink i need that um i picked up some chicken gravy i love chicken gravy i'll have it on beef pork we like our meat um but yeah chicken gravy all the way i just prefer it um and i picked up of this i picked up some of this i've never tried it before it's a fabric re um refresher 24 hours of freshness now this was 199 i think and it's cotton fields and magnolia really pretty bottle and I think this is part of their like new range by Airwick. Shall I spray a bit? It's meant to be on fabric, but I'm using it as an air freshener. Oh, okay. Okay. Look, okay. That smells really nice, actually. I'm really happy I picked that up. I'll give that a try. And oh my god, there's just there's just too much. Um, and I picked up some really random, which is this. Now, this is called a water feature LED light. It was $3.99, and you have a remote with this one. Now, I have, I, did, I picked up a light before, meant to be for the bath, but I put it in the shower, and honestly, it was the best thing ever. So, we had a shower, we put this light in the shower tray thing, we lit it up and it was like a spa. Now, I'm not even joking. You was having a shower like you was in a spa. And it was the best money I spent. But it kind of got damaged. I don't know why. Obviously, the water went into it. So, it's not the best quality. But I saw this one and this has got a remote. Um, so, I thought I'll treat us to another one and see how it goes. But honestly, it's so relaxing. If you've had a horrible, tough day get one of these in the shower or even the bath and just feel like you're in the spa put some spa music on wave music and you'll feel like you're in on holiday and then the last couple of things i got from b m was some of these photo frames sorry technical over there my device just dropped on the floor but like i was showing you i picked up these photo frames these are for a present but they're quite big they're 4.99 each and i picked up a white one and a black one and my second favorite favorite item from bnm apart from the seagrass wicker basket is um this great deal so i picked up this let's show you so if you can see it so this is a sculptured fur 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 throw. Is that how you pronounce it? That is, isn't it? Anyway, so it's 150 by 200 centimeters approx. It was 14.99, but I saw a buy for a tenner. And if you can see closely, it's so soft. And I saw it on the shelf. There was about three left and i was like i'm gonna have to pick it up i'm gonna have to so i did like i said that was 10 pounds and that is gonna go straight in the living room my friends um so that was oops it is, eh? so that was i hope that wasn't too quick but that's pretty much that i got from b m so let's just show what i've got from Dunelm. i mean oh god 
got done now. Um, it's always an experience in that. I always find it too warm and I'm sweating. I'm like, <sighs> and um, but I quickly just went round and I did find a couple of nice little gems in there. So the first thing I picked up, which I wanted for so, so long, was um, eucalyptus. Oh my goodness, these were the last two in the box because they've got like a flower range. I was obsessed when I saw them. I've seen them everywhere. Everyone's having them. And I'm, I'm yeah, it might sound like I'm following the train, but the aesthetic look and feel that I like in my living room, these all look perfect. Um, and I am looking to do like a little living room tour soon um because i've had quite a few messages on instagram saying i want to see all your living room even though i do take pictures but they want me like just have a quick chat and i was like you know what i will but i'll do it as a video and i picked up two of these now these were two pound each so i picked up two because you there's no point we could pick up one actually there's enough there but i just wanted two I thought I only picked up a couple of bits, clearly not. So, um, from the, like I said, they had a sale on and they had some of these trays, if I'll show you closely. So these were £4 each, reduced to £2, so I picked up two of them. And they're quite big actually. Um, and yeah, £2. We needed some new trays. They are trays, aren't they? Yeah. Um, like a mat, like a mat feel, um, which is quite nice. And I thought, you know what, they're quite pretty. So I picked up two of them. I've got my receipt here. It's always the worst bit, isn't it? Looking at the uh, the receipt. Um, and um, when I went to the till part, they had some cleaning products. So I picked up some toilet cleaning wipes. I don't, oh yeah they are they they kill 99.9 percent .9 of um of bacteria okay that's good so they are a pain they're most of their wipes section of their branded section if that's even a thing they're all a pain so i picked up them and i also picked up some stainless steel wipes as well again a pain and they are lemon citrus scented so there we go then I picked up, I can show you two candles. One's yellow one, which is um, jasmine and lang lang. Whatever, but that I thought that was quite pretty. And then I picked up this one for the living room, which is just a vanilla scent, which is uh, which these are a pound each. These are well in my store as soon as you walk in, so it's just it ju the disaster just starts there. Um, Dunalm also have these which is quite interesting now these weren't in the sale um, but these are £1.50 and these are t um, microfiber sponges they're honestly so thick and I love the design as well and I was like, oh, that's interesting. Because I kind of try B&M sponges, the minky sponges. But these look actually really good. Um, so for £1.50, I'll just pick them up. And these were another little sale item from Dunelm. These are just some jars. Storage jars. Jars. Oh, gosh. Me. so yeah i'm not sure what i'd use these for to be honest um i was thinking that and debating that in the shop and then i was like well i'm just gonna get them because you never know so these were four pound 25 pence reduced to two pound 12 so guess what i got two so maybe i'll find something in the kitchen for those so that was pretty. Oh, okay. That was it from Donnell. But whilst I was turning round, there is a couple of more bits that I did get from B and M. First of all, I picked up this bucket. 
don't ask. I think it's for tomorrow when we, when I clean my car. But that was on special buy for one pound fifty, so I just bought it. Um, and really quickly, just to finish off the little haul, I picked up some. Um, is it Baptiste? Baptiste? Is that how you pronounce it? Dry shampoo in the fruity and cheeky cherry um, scented flavour, whatever. So that I bought some of that. It's my favourite. Um, some deodorant. You know, I'm gonna spray those armpits. Um, and I picked up some Sephora, of course. Gonna top that up in my favourite scent, mandarin and lime. And oops, let's get that out of the way. This was actually really pretty. So this is a candle. Let's show you there. That was five pounds, and I was thinking, I was debating whether to get it, but I thought for five pounds, that is quite a big candle. Um, it's in my favourite colours at the minute, and I just love the look of it. And this is um, a Serenity Spa candle, um, so it's fr um, fresh, relaxing blend of magnolia and something wood. I'm not very good at pronouncing names, but. I thought that was really pretty so I thought I'd pick that up and it's a three wick which I do love it's really it's quite really nice and fresh it's almost got like a scent of like lemon in it oh well so that's the living room which is perfect um that is it I think a lot isn't it but that's what i mean because i brought quite a lot i was like i've got to do a haul even though it is a b m haul again i did go into dunelm and i did a little bit of dunelm as well um not a lot from dunelm i don't think there's anything else on there just making sure there isn't um but anyway that's the haul finished it i've got such a drive throughout <coughs> oh god i'm gonna finish this and I'm going to put all of this away and yeah thanks for watching guys um if you want to you can like and subscribe to my channel for more of these hauls um I want to do a video next week um I think I'm going to go back to a car boot and um, i think i might do a bit of vlogging and if i pick up any bargains i'm gonna do a video on it um, which is really exciting because i'm kind of glad they're opening now so i can get some stuff um and yeah that's pretty much it so thanks for watching guys and i'll check you later